sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. All right, Fuzz Pie Guy here. I'm going to show you how we can boot the uh, Raspberry Pi from a USB device if it's a solid state drive using a USB SATA adapter or USB thumb drive or whatnot. In this video, I'm going to be using just a simple USB 3 uh, thumb drive. To do this, we're going to use the Raspberry Pi imager. And I have an SD card plugged into the computer here. And we're just going to click on Choose OS, then we're going to scroll down to Miscellaneous Images, click on Bootloader, and click on USB Boot. Now this is going to copy over a couple little files onto the uh, SD card that we need to plug into the PI in order for this to work, at least doing it this way. All we need to do is just throw them onto the SD card then once this is done we're going to plug the SD card into the Pi let it uh, load up you if you have a monitor plugged in you're going to see a green screen let it go for at least maybe 10 15 20 seconds once it's done booting up to the green screen just simply unplug the SD card from the Pi. So let me go ahead and plug in my plug it into my Pi here. All right, so it booted up. I got the green screen. I'm going to let it go for a few seconds here. Then once that's done, unplug it. We'll take the SD card out. We'll put in our USB drive that we're using. And also we need to put an SD card into the SD slot that has an image on it that we want to copy and run off the USB. Let's do that. Now once we have that SD card in and you turn the Pi on, it might take a few extra seconds for it to boot up because it's going to try to boot from a USB drive even though the USB drive is not ready. So once it's up to the desktop, well, I'm using the desktop version here. Let me VNC into it. All right, so right now I have the USB drive uh, plugged into the Pi in the uh, blue USB port. And we have it right here. And uh, all we need to do to make this boot up off of USB, we'll just go up here, click on the icon. We'll go down here to accessories, SD card copier. We'll select the SD card and we'll select the drive that we want to copy on. And we'll click start. Then are you sure? We'll say yes. Now this is going to take a little bit depending on what type of uh, USB thumb drive or solid state drive shouldn't take too too long but this USB drive is not the fastest. So anyway once this is done you'll just click OK, power off the Pi, well remove the SD card and turn it back on and you should be good to go and booting off of the uh, USB drive. Hopefully this helps out and uh, as you can see it's starting to copy here but like I said it'll take a little bit. Be patient. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for another one.